there's the base here it goes inside the car then you got the cap that goes on the outside of the car it's real thin glossy like glass and two weatherproof washers that go one inside I guess it'll go like there and then one on the outside that goes here they'll meet on the inside and outside screwed together with this bolt that's it that's the whole kit so another quick easy way to do this would be to take the screw put it onto the allen wrench have your gasket ready and just go ahead and put the screw directly into the cap until it's tight. Don't over torque it because you don't want to, I guess, crack out. I guess this thing can seem like it's made out of metal, but you don't want to damage it. Get that in there nice and tight, right? So it doesn't turn anymore. And then just go ahead and put this on the outside of the car. So now what you'll do is you'll take the cap with the screw already in it and the gasket in place. Just go ahead and lay that down just like that. Get it centered where it's covering up everything and then just go on the underside and apply the base screw to that once you have it centered probably should just go ahead and put some tape on it to hold it in place so it doesn't move once you think you found the perfect location for it and then look like it's right in the center so now you should be able to take the gasket and the base and just screw that right into place. Till it's tight. All right, and now that's nice and snug. And then you can just go ahead and remove your tape and you got a nice flush slug plug. I think that might have been a little bit quicker. One more shot of everything before I go ahead and put all the covers back on. That's the base and the Allen screw in place. And plug. 